Okay, I'm just gonna get back here. And I'm gonna move your chair down so that I have better access to your teeth, okay? Yeah, like you. Fairly close to the ground, it makes things pretty easy on me. <laughs> yeah, these, these chairs are a little bit old. Kind of squeak a little bit. Okay. And I'm just going to lean your head back, okay? Just a little bit more. There we go. Alright, great. Okay, then. First things first. I should probably put on some gloves. you dressed with your bib. You do have some plaque building up on some of your teeth around your gums, which means when you're brushing, you're not brushing properly. So what you need to remember is to go all the way up to your gums and face up towards them with your brush. It's going to tickle and maybe bleed a little at first, but it's very important for your gum health and for your tooth health. But today, I'm going to go ahead and use my little scaler here, and I'm going to help you get rid of the plaque that's on there now, okay? I'll just do your front teeth first, and get your incisors. I'm going to move you up just a little bit. There we go. Okay. Open wide. Great. Being very gentle around your gums here. Let me know if you need a break. like you have a little chip on your first organ so 
visor. Kind of looks like you had a cap on it at one point. That's something we can fix up if you'd like. But it's a small chip. And if it hasn't hurt you at all, it won't in the future. Okay. okay. Take a look behind these, see if we need to get, yeah. get behind the incisor. Looks like they will. I have another tool that looks a little like a fish hook. This one gets up and behind, okay? Good. The bottom row. Switch back to this one. Don't mind my stomach there. <laughs> I haven't eaten breakfast yet. comfortable? Give me a second. Yeah. Rest your mouth a little bit. Let me see the back ones now. Take a look at your molars. Looks like they need a little bit of scaling too. Okay. Not a problem. I'm going to start on your left side. Your mouth. Okay. starting on your right side. <laughs> Sometimes I don't know my right from my left.
gorgeous day out there. Sorry, you're stuck in a dentist chair. Don't worry, I'll have you out here soon. Just. just going to be doing the scaling and then I'll do a little flossing for you and then I'm just going to do a quick sonic cleaning and then you'll be good to go Be careful with these. They're like little needles. <laughs> Poke myself once or twice with them. Okay. Looks like um not to have your wisdom teeth out. Well, that's going to be just fine. As long as they don't crowd your mouth. As long as you come in for your yearly cleaning, we can keep an eye look like one of them has a gum flap over it, which is going to make it very hard to care for. So, keep an eye on that too. So if it starts to rot out, then it's best to just get rid of them. But pulling teeth does cause a lot of trauma to your jaw. If you don't have to do it, sometimes it's better not to. So. Okay, go ahead and take a quick little break. Rest your jaw. Okay, I'm just going to do the other side and then we'll be done with the scaling part, okay? Get my... tell that you favor your right side for chewing. Okay, your left side has a lot less going on, plaque-wise at least. Okay. to breathe in, but you get used to it after a while.
We're almost done. Don't worry. I haven't hurt you at all, have I? Good. I have pretty steady hands. Okay. There's one more tooth back here. Just the upper wisdom tooth. Take a little break. I'm gonna get your floss ready. We'll just do a little bit of flossing. It looks to me, from what I can see, you are a good flosser, which is great because that's the hardest thing to get our patients to do. Okay, let me know when you're ready. Okay, and then we're just going to do the ones up. side. I'm going to get a new piece of floss. This one. They pretty much used it up. Nice long piece there. Oop. That didn't work so well. Come on. There we go. Open up for me, please. Thank you. I know, we're getting close to being done. You know, it's a little ironic, but I am nervous at the dentist. <laughs> yeah. I have a complex about always wanting to be good, and I took very bad care of my teeth when I was young. And because of that, every time I go in, something new is wrong with my teeth, and I feel like such a bad girl. <laughs> Not the, you know, I just feel like I'm back in elementary school and I'm getting scolded. Makes me sad. So, yeah, I get nervous about going to the dentist. Not because I'm afraid of pain, although I am kind of a wimp. Okay. That looks good, my friend. Yeah, we are down to the last step. Okay. 
I just need you to gotta find my there we go. Where's that? And where's I'll set up here. Okay, so I'm just gonna kind of do a polish sonic cleaning of your teeth, okay? And I have some mint polish right here. That we're gonna put on it. Tastes great, I promise. Okay, I need you to open up. Okay. Okay. Good to go. Get you seating back up here. Take off your to make an appointment to come back in, in a year's time to get another cleaning and we'll take a look at your teeth then, okay? Okay, have a good one. Bye. Look for you. We'll look inside. I'm also going to gently press around the ear just to kind of get a sense of um, any kind of inflammation. Okay. Let me grab my otoscope and put it together here. I just like to use a new one of these for you so it's not all dirty from somebody else. And I'm going to start in your left ear, okay? Alright, let's take a look. <laughs> 